how to succeed. Build houses and live in them. Plant gardens and eat their produce. Take wives and have sons and daughters. Take wives for your sons and give your daughters in marriage that they may bear sons and daughters. Multiply there and do not decrease. Jeremiah 29, 5 to 6. The faithfulness that individual Christians demonstrate in their everyday lives makes a compelling case that the Christian worldview is both true and good. Every square inch of reality was created by God and exists under the rule and reign of Jesus Christ. Every Christian is on the front lines. Christian faithfulness, especially at a time of cultural chaos, isn't really about trying to do great things for God. Afraid for the nation? Buy a house. Plant a garden. Get married. Have lots of babies. Help your children marry well. Be great grandparents. You needn't run for office. Start a podcast or lead a think tank. The most powerful and countercultural work happens in your home. God told the exiles of Judah to build houses and live in them, plant gardens and eat their produce. It can be easy to equate greatness with fame or followers or something loud and big, but God asks for faithfulness in whatever our hand finds to do. That was true for the exiles in Babylon, and it's still true today.